Good Rising family, Good Rising. Black Phoenix checking in, the owner of Hog On Welding and the founder of Welding and Hip Hop and the founder of Imagine Your Container. I wanted to come to you today and talk about our merch sale with the Hog On For Life t-shirts. When you purchase one, you will get a sticker. So that way you can put this sticker on your hard head or your welding hood. On the Hog On For Life t-shirts, this is actually a white one. It's an extra large. You see what it say? Hold on for life. And on the rear, I got the website. For these shirts right here, we are selling these for $30. And that's including the shipping. And normally the shipping don't be over $10. So I'm pretty much not charging you a lot for the shirt. But it's, this money is actually being used to help kick off the cafe and get things off the ground. I also have people that wanted to buy plaques. We're gonna have sections inside the cafe, inside the hall gone uh, container storefront where you can be able to buy a plaque for $100 to advertise your business, your service, your website, what you do. So when people come down and visit, they can be recognized. Your business as being part of how hall gone shipping container conversion got um, established because I'm using, I'm going to be putting a lot of focus on those who are helping us, you know, keep the ball going. And I wanted to show emphasis and shine emphasis on everybody that participate uh, and who have participated already in the development. So those who already have your name, don't even worry about it. It's going to be on there or your business or website, whatever you prefer. Um, but I do appreciate everyone for shopping with us and the advertisement, the way we will be doing that with the Hog On Cafe is it'll be $100 a year. So you pay $100 a year to advertise in that spot. And then once you say, hey, I don't want to advertise in the spot no more, the plaque that we make for you, we'll send it to you and you can keep it for your own personal use. So you still be able to benefit from it. You'll be able to utilize it and add it to your collection if that's something that you want to do. But I do appreciate everyone for tuning in, everyone for checking out the website. Just want to shout it out one time. That's www.hogonwelding.com. I appreciate everybody that's been checking it out. Those who have been subscribing to me on YouTube, I appreciate that. I salute everyone in advance. For those who are going to, from my Facebook and Instagram and Twitter accounts, so um, just appreciate those who are following. Like I say, our goal is to help other people build their independence this year and coming into 2021. And we're going to be doing that by using uh, high cube shipping containers, cutting them in half, turning them into two different units, two different high cube 20 foot units to be able to start people independence from their barbershop salons, their uh, their photo, uh, photo booths, their kiosks. Um, their shops, whatever you name it, their merch stands, their podcasts, whatever. We, the goal is to gain our independence and really own how we make our money. I read an article before I let y'all go the other day that kind of bothered me. It was a, a business that <clears throat> had been in business, it says, for 25 years at this one location and everybody knew this business and they had to close their doors, not because they wanted to go out of business because they was forced to go out of business because the landlord of the location of the plasma they was in jacked the rent up so high so that way accommodate for some the new movement and they weren't able to accommodate for that um, new price so they had to shut down their business couldn't afford to relocate now they're out of business <clears throat> for 25 years all I'm saying is investing in the shipping container can prevent you from doing that. You can rent a land or buy a piece of property, but you can own your business. You can have two shipping containers. You can have three, four, one, whatever you want. But if you own it, you got more power. And I think coming into 2021, it's all about power. It's all about us taking advantage of our, <clears throat> our resources. And I think shipping containers is great. So I want to lead by example by showing you what I'm going to do with mine. So I appreciate those who are making donations, those who are held, those who um, are purchasing the shirts, those who are purchasing the consultations, those who are just wanting to just help out. I appreciate it. I want to let you know everything is going to a good cause. Our goal is to teach independence, to turn a trade into a business by teaching welding independent uh, sessions. We're going to be teaching flux core and stick welding are the two main things that we're going to be teaching because right now, me personally, I believe field wielding is a great asset. <clears throat>
So if you are failing, if you are someone who don't have a GED, if you are someone who feel like you have to go to college, you got to get in debt in order to get into this. I want to break that curse. I want to break that myth of thinking that because we can do this. And I think that using field welding is going to be your key to get in because all you have to do is pay for your certifications, have the audacity and the strength to actually go after the trade and do it and your life can change. And once you actually get the trade, pay for your independency. You just have to realize there is no such thing as something for nothing. Everything that costs something in life that we value, we had to pay a price for it. Some type of price. Some prices we to pay for some things we don't even want to share with no one. But that's the facts of life. So I want to be able to help you build your independence with a shipping container conversion. Build your independence by learning to trade, by learning welding. And in the future, our goal is to have other tradesmen around where you can be able to learn different trades to help you do what you do. So I appreciate those who are shopping with me this morning. Hope everybody have a blessed weekend. Y'all be safe.